first I will make a cut and now in order to select this clip press Control plus up arrow. In this way, it would highlight the clip and select it. And then press Shift plus delete to ripple delete it. On another example, I make the cut at the beginning of the clip and then I press Control plus down, but then it will select the clip next to the clip I want to select. But don't worry, simply press Control plus up arrow to select the clip. And finally, if you will go to the sequence tab and check selection follows playhead then you could use your left arrow or right arrow or down or up arrow to get to the next clip and now wherever the playhead is on that clip would be automatically selected and then you can easily ripple delete it the only drawback is you won't be able to delete a gap using this method to be able to delete gaps and more please watch my other videos on the screen and if this video was helpful please don't forget to subscribe and like to help others find this video